Alfredo Pasta is a short shot party dish. It's equally loved by adults and kids and it's gourmet taste with few ingredients. You don't need any artificial flavorings or sauces or ajinomoto. Let's see how this is made. Meanwhile, have you seen my chocolate cake with a less sweet frosting? Please do watch that. Welcome to Delic Fling, tasty, healthy and easy recipes. The ingredients are any kind of pasta, I've used a spaghetti, chicken, mushroom, garlic, onion, oregano, butter which is optional and pepper, milk. To the recipe, add 3 cups of water. The pan which we use should be big enough to cook pasta. Add salt. I've used a spaghetti, so once the bottom part of the spaghetti gets soft, just turn around and check your package instructions for cooking time. To another pan, add oil. I've used your olive oil. You can use any vegetable oil, but uh, please try not to use coconut oil because it's an Italian dish. So you don't need much of coconut flavor. Add chicken boneless pieces preferably breast pieces it will take around five minutes to cook season it with salt and pepper make sure it doesn't stick to the bottom so sort in between since we are not adding any additional flavorings seasoning is very important you can replace shrimp or prawns for chicken it goes really well also transfer to another bowl once chicken is ready you don't need to fry chicken too much just five minutes to the same pan add butter and oil do not wash the pan before using because we need all the chicken flavorings on the bottom of the pan to be in this recipe Add thinly sliced onions. The flame should be low. Sort until it's translucent. And once it's ready, add minced garlic. So if you don't like garlics, stick to three. If you like garlics, you can use four, five garlic cloves. Sort another 30 seconds. After that, you can add the star ingredient, that is mushrooms. Mushrooms are a great source of vitamin D. And I never liked mushrooms before making this dish. But now, I buy two packets. And you'll be amazed how mushrooms can elevate a dish. It has got an umami taste. And once it's light brown, you can add milk. You can replace cream with milk, but I have always used milk in this recipe. If you don't have mushrooms, still you can use cream and cheese to make Alfredo pasta. But next time when you see mushrooms, please make sure you buy it and make this. So this will be your family favorite. Add the chicken pieces. You need to season it with some salt and pepper. Meanwhile, our pasta is ready now. Drain it and you don't need to add cold water. You can cook pasta until it's al dente or bite to the taste or you can cook a little more. Add the pasta to the mixture which we have kept it for simmer for 10 minutes. Once pasta is added, change the flame to medium and stir well. Heat it for another 1 minute and let it rest for 10 minutes. Switch off the flame now. You can see 
all the liquid have been absorbed by the pasta it's creamy it's gourmet and the kitchen smells amazing at this stage add some oregano if you have but i would highly suggest using oregano in this recipe it just elevates your normal dish to a restaurant quality transfer to another bowl this pasta is served best when it's warm and next time when you have a party make sure you make this and also buy mushrooms whenever you see in the shops now it's healthy also garnish it with some basil or parsley leaves it's not necessary your creamy pasta dish alfredo pasta is ready you can see the creaminess and this can be packed for lunches for office or for school feel free to replace chicken with prawns and try how it tastes next time when you want to make a pasta dish which every member of the family will like make this dish because this is a very hit recipe in our family if you like the recipe please do subscribe and share these are the ingredients list and if you like my recipe please do subscribe